My name is Lombe and I'm going to be talking to you about animals and their different specialities that they have to survive. Um, but before I start talking to you about my three favourite animals, here's a few facts about some certain animals which you might not have known. Did you know that an ostrich's eye is bigger than its brain? <laughs> a chameleon's tongue is faster than a fighter jet when it comes out to get a fly. Um, ants can lift 50 times their own weight. A tarantula spider can survive for more than two years without food. No, no two zebras have the same striped pattern. Beavers can hold their breath for about 45 minutes straight. Appro approximately 100 people die each year when they're stepped on by cows. Beware. <laughs> On average, sharks kill 10 humans every year. Owls are the only bird that can see the color blue. Owls. A mouse. <laughs> a mouse is so small compared to an elephant that an elephant does not even know that a mouse is around. It's like a human to an ant. Just don't know what it's about until you concentrate. And this leads me on to my three favorite animals. Um, first animal I'm going to talk to you about is the Komodo dragon, which is a rare lizard which is becoming extinct now. It's a deadly reptile and it's one of the largest, it's, it is actually the largest lizard on earth right now. And it is about 2.5 meters long when it's lying on its belly like this. That's eight foot tall when it's like that. and. It weighs about 200 pounds, which is 90 kg. And it has very poor eyesight and hearing, but when it flicks its tongue, like when it does that lizard reptile thing, it picks up scent molecules, which can tell the meat that's around in about 1.5 miles away. So if you're within 1.5 miles and it does that with its tongue, it knows where you are, basically. And it's got so much bacteria in its claws and its mouth that one bite could leave you unconscious in 15 minutes, basically. And it's basically a savage and a beast. It eats its own eggs. <laughs> <laughs> and it's got that tail as well. It's so strong, it's basically one big muscle. If that tail hits you, you can be in critical condition. <laughs> The second animal I want to talk to you is about a fish in the water called the mantis shrimp. It's got the fastest punch in the world, basically. It's got the acceleration of a bullet. It basically has got this thing where it holds its own arm back like that and then releases. And the energy punches through shells and that, so it gets its snails under, underwater. And usually they've done tests, like when they slow it down on the cameras, they see that there's light and heat produced underneath water. It goes as fast as a bullet. So that's very, 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 very dangerous. And the last one is the Indonesian mimic octopus, which is basically a coward. Basically, what it does to survive is mimic other animals, other deadly animals to survive. So it knows what prey uh, what predator is what for the prey. So if it sees an animal, an uh, uh, underwater animal, which is afraid of a uh, fish with poisonous spikes, it will adjust. It can change colours and change behaviour to suit that. It can, it's very clever if it sees like animals which are afraid of snakes, it tucks its body underneath and lets its tentacles hang out in a stri and it changes its colours so it stripes sort of like a snake, like an underwater snake and it swims on, on the, um, top of the water like the way a fish does. A deadly fish like swim in the middle of the sea because they're not afraid to swim in the corners or whatever. So it does that. That's all I've got to talk about. Any questions? You know that shrimp thing? Yeah. Is it harmful to humans or just underwater shell things? If it does get a human, you can break a leg. 
How big Very is clean. it? It is about the size of a ruler, a uh, 30 centimeter ruler. And that's a shrimp? Yeah. Um, my second question is, how, how does an octopus mimic, like, say it was like a fish with spikes, how, did, how, would, how does it mimic things? I'm confused. It literally, sure. it copies other animals' behaviours and stuff. So the fish don't know what it looks like, it'll just go after like, the behaviour of it? And no, it will, it will see like an animal, like when it's growing up or whatever, it will oh. see animals and instantly it's got that and it can mimic it. And it can camouflage into walls, it can basically do that. You and mimic the texture. It can mimic the texture as well as the colours of it. So. Oh, okay. All right. Thank you. Any more questions? Um, you see, when you when you said about the elephant um, and the mouse. Mm -hmm. So the, the elephant doesn't actually know where the mouse is. It even though even though it's depicted that it's scared of them. They aren't actually scared of mice. That's oh, okay. not true. Okay. But basically. An elephant, if a, a rat walks into a room, elephant will notice it. Serious? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Just like the same way there may be three or four ants in this room and we don't know.